So now doing this for over a year and helping lots and lots of clients, the number one question we get is, so you really help us find the right spot in Boise? <laughs> Uh, it's yeah. yes, that is exactly what these videos are for and what our team here is for. So in this video, uh, we're, we're doing a whole video about searching where to live in Boise. So we want to break it down, kind of talk about some of the major areas that people are focusing their attentions on. So you'll have a good understanding of some of these areas that fit your lifestyle and some of them that won't. So if you want that information, we're getting after it right now. What's up, everybody? My name is Jackson Wilkie. Sean Tomich. We are the Living in Boise team. If this is your first time to this channel, you want to learn everything about what it's like to work, eat, sleep, live, play, and those perfect areas to live, make sure you tap that subscribe button. Click the bell so you're notified every time we do a new video. We honestly do get so many phone calls, emails, texts every single day. We absolutely love it. So thinking about moving anywhere in this Treasure Valley area, make sure you give us a call, shoot us a text, send us an email, days, nights, weekends. We got your back when moving to Boise. All right, Sean, so that was one thing that kind of blew us away a lot was just, oh my gosh, you guys really do help us. Uh, in fact, you tell a story. I mean, that's what somebody told you, right? Well, one of the funniest things is uh, when I pick up the phone, the yeah. first thing that I, one of the first things I hear is, let's see if he's gonna answer the phone. Yeah. And then I'm like, hey, this is Sean. <laughs> well, wait, whoa, oh, I'm sorry, I wasn't expecting you. Well, yeah, I'm here, this is really me. Yep. But uh, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, that's it's it's pretty cool um, getting to to work with people when they give a call in, and there's there's um, lots of lots of sorts stories and success stories. Exactly. Um, yeah, I mean there really are. But and that's well, that's um, the one thing about it too is that we um, people don't really realize that you know Boise it's spread out, it's sprawled out, and there's there's completely different lifestyles. You know, a lot of times people have it in their mind like. Oh my gosh, it's just this little small town. I'll be able to get anywhere quick and uh, and it's all the same, but it's it's really not. So the whole goal of this video is just kind of emphasizing that and and talking across these um, these cities about the differences. So yes, we do help with that. It's just one thing. Like when you start talking to, you know, Sean, the team of like, oh my gosh, I need this. I want to be close to that. My lifestyle, the style of home. It's like, okay, boom, this, this area is going to fit you. So let's just start ripping first and foremost. I'm just going to kind of name the the city area and you're going to talk about you know some some things going on in that area maybe there's some new hot spots and then also the the style of lifestyle there so first and foremost the one you know the best and where probably the majority of the clients are or landing is nampa let's let's get into that yeah um that's correct um a lot of people mm -hmm. are moving to nampa nampa and caldwell they're kind of connected but it's uh a lot of people are gravitating toward nampa nampa is actually the second largest city in in Idaho next to Boise. So there's a lot of room. It's been a, a farm town all its life. And so there is a lot of room to grow there. And because of that, people are gravitating and moving there because the it's still affordable. I mean, you can still right now get into a, a real nice three bedroom, two bath in Nampa and be in the 300s mm -hmm. um, and, and have a really nice place to live, a comfortable place to live. So that is one of the, you know, the biggest reason that a lot of people are gravitating toward Nampa uh, in Boise, you know, your median home price right now, and this is what, November of 2021, yep. um, we're, you know, still hovering uh, over half a million. So yep. not everybody coming over here can afford that half million dollar home. And typically they end up in, in somewhere around Nampa or Caldwell a lot of times. Yep. And so Nampa is going to put you now, you know, south of downtown, but still not too far from anything. You will, yes, be driving through farm fields um, real quickly like what's really attractive uh, in Nampa for a lot of people because it's self-sustained. Um, is it just price points? What is it? So it didn't used to be self-sustained. So mm -hmm. back, back in the day when I was growing up, um, if you lived in Nampa, number one, you were really far away and like, <laughs> Oh, I can't leave you commute to Nampa from Nampa every day. And, um, but there's, uh, there's a really, uh, a lot of cool things about Nampa and it's a, it's a different culture. It's a different lifestyle. It is more rural. Um, but yes, it's also self-contained now, self-sustained now. So people that live in Nampa, they really don't even need to travel to Boise Meridian, um, to, to go and eat, shop, play, do the things that they're needing to do prior to all of this all now being there. But Nampa actually has everything you need now. Um, it is very self-contained. Um, and it does provide a, a, a really cool lifestyle. Yep. So pre-COVID, a lot of people, you know, um, 
during relocation, obviously Idaho's lifestyle, some people just moved because of that. But pre-COVID, it was for jobs a lot of times. And so they kind of had to be closer during COVID. And I guess it's not post-COVID, but um, it's more lifestyle and I can work from home. So the Nampa stretch isn't, we're just not seeing that be a factor. And that's why like they're continuing to see the sprawling and building out. But to bring it in closer, um, the first kind of big suburb that blew up was Meridian. Let's just, why would people choose Meridian and what's the, the, the feeling lifestyle there? Um, the, the <clears throat> lifestyle feeling is a little bit different in Meridian mm -hmm. and typically, and we talk a lot about this Jackson about when people call in, you know, really, I, I ask a lot of questions. Yep. I want to know a lot about you. I want to know about kind of where you're living, what your the type of home you're living in now, what you're looking for. Um, because most commonly when people say, Hey man, I've, I've got, you know, three kids, I'm looking for good schools, I'm looking for something that's clean, safe, affordable, and kind of in the middle of everything. I do want to kind of be in the middle of the city and and, and, and a part of everything. Boy, I put them right in Meridian. I put mm -hmm. them as close to the village as I can because that's just a major hotspot and attraction and it's so family friendly. Uh, in the summers, every Friday, Saturday night, they're they're having concerts there and, and free concerts, free things like that. Right now, it's because it's cold. Um, they're setting up an ice skating rink in the middle of the village. Yeah. Um, there's a, a fountain in the middle of the village that was designed by the, the guy that designed the Caesars Palace fountain. I mean, it's just, <laughs> it's a really cool place and it's, it's very clean, very safe, very low crime. And that's, you know, the big reason that people want to move their families here is honestly, that's, you know, what we're seeing a lot of is they're just not happy with the things that are happening in the areas that they're in. Yep. And for locals here, um, the prices are just, you know, crazy. We can't believe what they're doing. But for people moving here from different states, this is still so affordable for them. So we have a lot of clients. Budget isn't as much of an issue for them. So they're stretching right. 800, 1.2, even 2 million. Um, the can't miss area and where they're going is Eagle. Let's talk about that. Correct. So again, another lifestyle chain. Eagle is a, a different lifestyle, different culture. That is absolutely going to be your more high end area. Uh, I mean, median price point in Eagle right now is is about nine hundred thousand. So just really get into something entry level in Eagle is going to. I mean, you're going to be well over half a million to that nine hundred range just to get into something entry level. Um, so yeah, that's that obviously is a is a different clientele. It's a different culture um, for sure. Yeah, so there's a um, couple different styles in uh, the Eagle area. Um, you grew up there. So talk about kind of like the two, three different styles they'll see in Eagle. So um, what's really cool about Eagle and honestly about everywhere in the Valley here is we have a very big mix of, of homes and different styles of homes. And you're going to see a lot of that craftsman style, mm -hmm. um, a lot of the farm home type style um, facades on, on many of our homes. That's just what people have gravitated toward and really love here, that product. But what you're really going to see as of probably like the last 10 years or so, but really in the last five is a lot of that really much more modern, much uh, more current um, architectural style. A lot of that you'll see there's, it's a lot of influence from California. So there's a yep. lot of that that very modern contemporary look and I personally, which I love, yep. I personally love it. Yep. Um, but yeah, so you're going to have a lot of mix of that. You're going to have a lot of product that has the RV bay that's attached to their very nice, beautiful modern home because we, a lot of people in Eagle and a lot of people in Idaho have their toys that's and right. we have to have places to put our toys. And that's, if you have that RV bay, man, it is a man cave dream. It is that's right. Man. Yep. So we're, what we want to do is just kind of take the uh, popular opinion of all these clients that we've helped move, relocate here. They're kind of their FAQs of each area and break it down. And, and w obviously, when you're moving to Boise, you think about Boise, Idaho. That's another area. So um, it, it's crazy because, yeah, you're moving to Boise, Idaho, but it really seems like some of these outline, you know, the Meridians, the Nampas, the Eagles yep. are focused the majority of people's attention. But um, some do just want Boise. So talk about, right. you know, Boise. Absolutely. And there's, there's so much opportunity in Boise and it's the thing about Boise is it's, it's very far spread mm -hmm. and you've got different pockets and, and the majority of it's going to be homes and communities and, and neighborhoods and established communities. And, um, you're going to see it varying from the forties and fifties in downtown Boise, you know, all the way up to current right now. And there's a lot of new construction. So yeah, absolutely. I mean, the Boise is the place that's the reason that it's, that's, it is now on the map is because 
it's a very centralized hub to everything you want. So it's your jump off point to get to the mountains, to get to the lake, to get to the river, to get to the trails, to, to, to shop, to all the hospitals are close, the schools are good. So that's the main hub of, hey, if I can get into Boise, awesome. But when people get here, what they end up realizing is that um, boy, the, the Treasure Valley here, our valley, it's like five or six days all combined. They're all touching. They all feel the same. It all kind of feels like Boise. So when we say, like when I go out of town and people ask me where I'm from, I just say Boise. I don't say yep. Nampa, yep. Idaho, because everyone knows Boise and that's that's where I'm from. So Exactly. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, you know, the, these are kind of, we're, we're trying to actually relay these videos as of like we're talking to clients. So yes, we are the ones who answer the phone calls. We actually just open up the conversation to asking you questions. We want to hear from you. That's what sparks our mm -hmm. ideas um, and go, right. okay, I, like we know the street that would actually fit exactly what you're talking about. So yeah. this is what we love doing. And, and, and the only way that we can truly help you to find your perfect spot here in the Treasure Valley is you got to reach out to us. You got to give us a call, shoot us a text, send us an email. Days, nights, weekends, we got your back when moving to Boise, Idaho. And until the next video, guys, we'll catch you later.